To make our sheet model, we're going to follow the same process we did for our drawing model. I'm going to copy the 2D metric seed file, go to my sheets folder, we'll paste that in here, and then we're going to rename that one. And this will be our, our sheet, sheet file. Now let's go ahead and open that. Again, we'll go back to open up our models dialog. We'll select our model. And this time we're going to change this to a sheet model. And then we're going to change the name to the metric sheet. Let that change take place. And you can go ahead and verify the settings of the annotation scale, paper scale, propagate, line style scale, update fields automatically. Also, you can go ahead and set your sheet size to ISO A1 because this is metric. If you were doing Imperial, you might suggest uh, looking at the ANSI D uh, for a typical full size plan sheet. And so once those are set, go ahead and save your settings. Again, as mentioned in the prior video, verify your working units, which again is under File, Settings, File, and Design File Settings. Make sure these are all going to match up with your seeds. One important change that we're going to make to our sheet seed is to change the accuracy all the way to eight decimal places. This comes into play when we're placing our name boundaries for cutting sheets when we deal with scales like 1 to 500 ratio uh, for imperial we might be dealing with uh, 1 inch to 50 feet this accuracy affects that dialogue and so when you put in for example stations or vertical exaggerations those types of things you want the accuracy for your sheet to be as precise as possible which directly affects that particular dialogue it doesn't affect your design or your labels, but it does affect that particular dialogue. So only in your sheet C do we want to change this accuracy to eight decimal places for imperial and metric. And with those changes made, go ahead and select OK. And let's go ahead and save your settings one more time. And then we can go ahead and close out as this completes this task. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.